What's going on ballers? Thanks so much for tuning in once again to a Big J Basketball box break video. Today we're going back to 1819 doing some retail threads and status. This will be another uh, product battle. Can we get better cards out of two threads hanger boxes or two status hanger boxes? Um, these were on sale at DA Card World during their anniversary sale a few weeks ago, I think. Um, so I picked these up for a pretty good price. Definitely above retail price, but um, way less than what they were trending at um, as of right now. I think Blow is trying to sell these for like, you know, 30 or 40 bucks a piece, which is crazy. Um, so I got them on a nice sale, uh, less than that. Um, hopefully you can pull out of this thread something as nice as that Luca Dazzle um, that was in my recent PSA submission video. That's a mint nine. That one's up on my eBay right now. Check the... Uh, everything in the video description uh, for all my eBay information and, and email and Instagram and all that stuff. Instagram, Big J Basketball. If you're interested in anything I have on eBay, go ahead and uh, get that name. It's Big J Basketball as well. It's all everything's Big J Basketball. It's all the same. Um, so check out my eBay if you're interested in that Luca. Um, and then this one's not for sale, the Luca Optic, but I did pull that out of 1819 retail as well. And in the back, you can see all the other various uh, 1819 hobby boxes uh, I've opened since last year and up until now, still doing 1819 stuff when I can. I still have a 1819 hobby box of hoops that I'll get to at some point. That's just kind of been sitting around. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get these ripped open. Maybe we'll do status, status first and thread second. The status boxes are a little bigger. There's 30 cards per pack and threads only has 20. So maybe we'll get the big boxes out of the way first. Do some status and then do some threads. I'll just cut all these open now. If you guys don't want to watch me cutting these open and listening to the loud noise of this heavy plastic, you can go ahead and fast forward uh, the ripping of the plastic and get started in just a second here. Get this last one open. That way we're not ripping boxes later in the video. Okay. My last video was another product battle as well. If you have not seen that one yet, I highly recommend checking that out. Um, did some more mosaic for Mosaic Mondays. You're not gonna wanna miss what we pulled out of uh, that mosaic hanger box. Pretty awesome card. So definitely go back and check out the last video if you haven't seen it yet. All right, so here's what we can pull out of here. So there's. Definitely some really good cards. Number 99 down to one of ones. There's prime swatches number to 10. Um, you can even pull the uh, pursuits, which are those die cuts that are super short prints, uh, the case hits. So we pulled one out of the uh, pursuit out of the 1718 uh, status hobby box I ripped here on the channel. Unfortunately it was Ryan Anderson, but that's okay. It was still a nice case hit. Okay, I don't, I think I've opened any 1819 status on the channel ever. I've opened a bunch off camera, but it's a nice looking card. It was a retail only for 1819. So there's the front and there's the back. If you guys want to check out the status, definitely a good product. Unfortunately, all the 1819 retail stuff is, you know, sold out everywhere. And if you want to pay to resale, you can. Um, like I said, I, I probably wouldn't have bought it if, if DA Cardwell didn't have that sale or I got it pretty cheap. Cat, Tim Hardaway Jr., Kyle Lowry, Rodney Hood. So here's a hanger box exclusive blue parallel. This one's Dirk Nowitzki. We got a Dwayne Wade symbols. So it's a nice hollow finish there, but not nothing special, not numbered. Okay, we've got rookie. Prominence, Moritz Wagner. Again, these are, I'm pretty sure, not numbered. Nope. And here's our other rookies. So we got, I like how all the rookie cards have this nice kind of hollow finish to it. Hamidou Diallo, Chandler Hutchison, Svi Mikhailuk, I think. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Bruce Brown, D'Anthony Melton, Blue Parallel, and Jared Vanderbilt. So, wow. Very bad rookies in that box. Maybe you guys are fans of some of those guys, but none. Oh, hey, LeBron. All right. That's our biggest hit 
out of the first one. LeBron, anything, especially if they're in good condition. KD, it's not bad. Eric Bledsoe, PG, Cantor, and Blake Griffin. Yeah, even LeBron's base cards, if they're in good condition and grade really well, will pull a lot of money. Okay, so that's hanger box number one. Nothing thick in here, so no jersey cards. But again, jersey cards aren't really the big draw. Um, you know, you can get autographs from the rookie class. So a nice auto would be awesome. Again, I know it's super tough to pull autos out of these things, but you never know. All right, hanger pack number two of status, and then we'll move on to threads, and we'll compare to see which one wins the battle. Embiid, Dirk, AD, Fournier, Chris Middleton, Tarian Prince, Ariza, Draymond, Harrison Barnes, Mike Conley. There's Dwight Howard. Blue parallel. Got a factions of Giannis, Middleton, and Bledsoe. Put that, it's a good card, Giannis. Tim Duncan, status quo. Okay, and here's our rookies. Miles Bridges, Omari Spellman, Robert Williams III, Zaire Smith, Devontae Graham, blue, that's not, not too bad. And Elio Kobo. Oh, so we didn't really do very well with the rookies on these. There's KD again, Bledsoe, Paul George, Cantor, all the same cards we got in the last pack. Blake Griffin, then Whiteside, Jalen Brown, George Hill. Wiggins, Wall, and Serge Ibaka. Okay, so nothing tremendous. Uh, so let's see if we can pull out of threads here. Yeah, and there's golds number to 10. There's one of ones. There you go, focus. Um, gold number to 10, black number to one. Signage and rookie signatures. Gold parallel, parallels number to 25, so we can pull autos. Out of threads, I don't think threads has jersey cards though, which is not a huge deal. I'm not not a big fan of this, those plain jersey cards, but it's weird that you have a product called threads, and you don't put actual threads of jersey cards in the packs. I always thought that was kind of interesting that threads does not have jerseys, but not a big deal. So we only get definitely get less cards with threads. So we only got 20 cards per pack. So this will go pretty quick. Got a bunch of dazzles. I don't see any colors though, so probably nothing numbered, but maybe we can get a rookie. Griffin, Vince Carter, Jonathan Isaac, Zach Levine, Drew Holiday. Here's our first dazzle. It's TJ Warren. Next dazzle is Buddy Heald. Mo Bamba rookie. Oh, I saw the blue. Oh, Jalen Brunson. <laughs> Too well, I've already gotten lucky and got that Luca back there. Would have been nice to get another one, but oh well. At least it's a rookie. Barkley. Anthony Davis. Lillard. Got another one. Stockton. Dazzle. Uh, put Barkley and AD here. Uh, insert John Stockton and then more base. Ariza, Levert, Kyrie, Kawhi, Josh Richardson, and Paul George. So nothing really. We got a Maverick rookie dazzle. Unfortunately, it was not the right Maverick. But maybe we can get a good rookie dazzle in hanger box number two. Okay, last pack to open here. So I guess status is kind of our winner so far. Um, but nothing, nothing super exciting yet. Ooh, we might have, oh, there's a thick card in here. So, okay, we are, maybe they do have jersey cards in here, huh? Or maybe the autographs aren't thick cards, I don't know. Well, I could be completely wrong and maybe we'll get a jersey card where I thought there were no jersey cards. Chris Middleton, Oladipo, Kalinari. Let's save this thick card till the end. So here's Kemba Walker Dazzle. Carl Anthony Towns Dazzle, rookie of Chandler Hutchison. Hey, there we go. There's the non-Dazzle. Oh, and double Luca, back to back, two Lucas. Nice. So we got the non-Dazzle version of that same Luca. All right. Okay. Uh, I think Threads wins. 
with these two Lucas. <laughs> nice. Back, nothing like getting back to back Lucas. Charles Barkley. Oops, some more of the same cards. Anthony Davis. Hey, and we got a Shea Gildas Alexander Dazzle. Definitely one of the top rookies from the 1819 class, along with Luca and Trey, Tim Hardaway, Reddick, Gary Harris, Montrez Harrell, Chris Paul, and Trevor Ariza. Let's see what this thick card is. Maybe I was totally wrong and there are thick jersey cards in here. Or maybe it's an autograph on a thick card. RTW oh, Rookie Threads, Wendell Carter Jr. Yeah. All right. Completely ignore that statement I made at the beginning about not having threads cards in threads. So not too bad. Wendell Carter Jr. Rookie Threads. Not a huge card, not numbered, uh, not a patch. That's a standard relic card, but... Okay, let's do a quick recap. So status was actually now pretty bad in comparison when you look at it. Devontae Graham Blue, Giannis Factions card, and a LeBron base is really all there was to write home about as far as status was concerned. And I think we can say Threads was the winner with our Wendell Carter Jr., Shea Dazzle, Luca Next Wave, and then a nice-looking base Luca card. Awesome. So, uh, yep, Threads won that one. Um, and even I like all these other Dazzles too. None of them were huge. We did get our rookie Dazzle in the Brunson. Um, we also got Mobamba, uh, a couple AD cards, Kemba, Cat. So definitely a lot better uh, this time around for Threads. But again, these hanger boxes can be really boom or bust. Um, Okay, so hope you guys like watching these uh, product battle videos. I like doing them. Uh, we'll be definitely be doing a lot more for Mosaic Monday again. Next week we'll have another product battle of a blaster and a hanger. Um, and I'm sure with uh, Chronicles coming out pretty soon, 1920 Chronicles, we'll do uh, some product reviews uh, of that as well. So stay tuned for more of those videos. And thanks for watching this one, and I'll see you guys on the next video.